Good morning guys, it's Monday and for some of us, uh, for a lot of us, because Canada Day was on a Sunday, we get the Monday off. Some people work the Sunday, so they would get the Monday off. Anyways, a lot of stores are closed today. Uh, Laura heard there was a grocery store open, so she's gone to that. And, look at the, this trailer is really bad for cooling down. So I had to install the doors here to the other room because that other room is like a furnace. Pretty much it's a furnace. There's no insulation and they tried to sell us on the fact that, oh yeah, this trailer is worth a lot of money because of the that one room in particular and I was like no that's not possible because it's not an insulated room so I decided to close all the doors of the trailer and have the air on there and this one I have all the windows on but the good thing about this room is that as soon as the sun goes down this room is cold again and I can turn the air on this room and it'll be freezing. I'm trying to find my hat. I don't know where it is. Anyways, because it's so hot out and it's early in the morning and the pool is open, we are gone to the pool. Going to the pool. Anybody see my hat? I know you guys don't like it. Both Alright, we're going to the pool. Without my hat. I better get that comfy seat in the shade. Do you remember how Laura said yesterday I left all the chairs there? I wanted to empty the truck before I went to town. Well, Laura took off and left all this beach stuff. Look at all this beach stuff she left here. And she left it all night. There's a blue towel in there. Oh, that's mine. <laughs> Are you ready? Let's get going. Oh, it's still wet. Yeah, well, put it in the sun. It'll be dry off. Day. We're at the pool and uh, it's almost lunchtime. Spent hours at the pool and my face is kind of red because couldn't find my hat. Good morning, guys. Welcome to today. If you can tell, I am a little bit of a lobster and I'm headed to go to the beach again in the sun. Hi, girly. Wear them on your new bathing suits. Yeah, so my sister showed up early this morning. She has a trailer here as well. If you guys um, have been following us for a year, then you have seen her. Um, and she stopped by this morning and was like, I'm going into town to get groceries. You want to go? And I said, yeah. So I found hats because after this, it's been like a scorching, scorcher of a weekend. And I needed my kids to wear hats. So you guys will match the trailer and the horses. What do you think? You like it? What the heck? Is there a bird attacking us? I think so. <laughs> <laughs> You're so crazy. How many kids do you know <laughs> that look like that? And uh, Can I see myself? In let me see your bathing suit. So um, I bought the girls four bathing suits this summer. I forgot and that I had this one. Did you? I knew you had it. And I was wondering why you never wore it. It's cute though. So this is cool. Love it. Turn around. Did Dad put any sunscreen on you? Yep. Can't you see? <laughs> Can't you see? She said. So basically it's gone all morning. And usually it's when I clean up and do all that kind of stuff before we go to the pool, but I didn't have a time. And of course Sam doesn't clean up officially. Um, so I said to my sister on the way back, at least like I hope he put sunscreen on Soapy because she had a sunburn, a bit of a sunburn and I don't want her in the heat again. So I pull into the to the trailer and he texts me and says, can you bring the sunscreen to the pool? And I'm like, oh, the hand. Anyway, what, what are you getting dad's money for? <laughs> <laughs> you need to rub that in and I need to do your shoulders. The treat star. Got all his money and all his cards. That's a weird wallet your dad has. 
It's weird. Yeah, Wait, let me put sunscreen on you. Is that the pool? Um, basically, my girls are at that age now where we can give them my bank card, give them our bank cards, and say, hey, go to the store. Like, only at the trailer, clearly, because it's so close. But, yeah, it's super fun that they can do all the shopping. in the pool. We ride hippos. Okay, okay. These things are amazing for core balance. You guys remember Shayla? <laughs> there was one boy who asked us, he was like, can I, can I try and you're like, sure. And then he like chickened out. Yeah, we're going to do the bull again. Like if you're going to chicken out then, then don't even ask at all. Right, yeah, we brought that alligator. Hey, I'm riding the hippo. <laughs> Mom, I'm riding this fucking congo. Hey! I'm riding it. <laughs> I need you. We got Sophie with the hat. Where's your new hat? I bought you a new hat. That is not where the hat goes. The hat goes on your head. Luckily you're sitting in the shade. So we got some nacho chips, some cherries, some, what do you have there? Nacho sauce. Nacho cheese, you know, that bad stuff that poisons you from the inside out. <laughs> uh, we got a veggie tray and a whole huge bag of cherries. Show the whole bag of cherries. Yeah, because we eat cherries. Where are the cherries that we took to the horse show? Did we eat the whole bag? This is our third bag of cherries we in a week. before the horse show. You ate the whole bag before the horse show? No wonder I didn't see them. I got carrots. That's us. Mom, where's the nacho chip? There's the cheese, there's the chip. I don't know if you guys can see, but all around us is a shroud of steam of smog but th there's not as much here as there is in town anyway um my niece sarah is here i don't know if you guys remember me talking about her in the past she's here her they have a trailer here as well um she was the she's 16 she's really small and gabby and her gabby last year at 10 was the same size as her at 15 and this year i put them back to back and what happened gabby i was like four inches taller than four inches like she comes to here on gabby gabby is all this much that's how much she grew in a year isn't that crazy mm -mm. it was my legs that were growing yeah all your legs no rest of you grew right yeah. yeah anyway we are headed to the barn in a little while we're hoping to shoot a new intro now that we have our own horses we can't go and bother the horses in this heat um shayla actually has riding lessons today right mm -hmm. yeah and our barn does not Hopefully ride in the heat it's late at night you don't panic cold. you guys and because they yeah they panic about everything <laughs> they panic about everything <gasps> spoken from a 10 year old from an 11 year old no she won't be riding later in the afternoon do you always ride at five o'clock at night mm -hmm. yeah mm -hmm. it'll be nice and cool there except for the winter because it's hard on the horses lungs. yeah mm -hmm. yeah we we don't ride when it's really really cold too
We have two horses now. We have two horses. If you guys remember when Storm, if you guys remember when we first saw Storm, he was Western and um, it wasn't a health issue, but it was a transition getting him back to English. And it took, I mean, it's only been three months that we've had him and he's a different horse. In three months, Stella is gonna be a massively changed horse as well. So yeah, all we have to do now is put in time and effort and energy and we're really happy to do that but wow I feel so much better knowing that we have two horses I keep getting um, emails from like from websites saying hey we found a match for you and I'm like oh I never want to look at a horse ad again for a long 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 time it was just so stressful another lady at our barn is trying to buy a horse for her kid and legit she is so stressed out over the process and I'm like I hear ya been there I'm just glad we're done are you glad you are done looking yep. for your horse so what do you think of her I love her yeah Slow down. so it's gonna be a transition guys she's gonna be a transition she's gonna have good days and bad days and I hope you guys understand that um She's not perfect, but none of us are perfect. We took a chance on her, and even if the chance didn't pay off and all we could do was keep her and love on her and spend time with her, that would have been okay with us. Feel okay, mine. so Feel mine. we got around. Mom, feel mine. Yeah, yours is super grippy. Okay, so this is Gabby's saddle, which she loves, right? But it's not a good fit for Storm. So this saddle came with him, we bought it with him. It was the saddle he had, but he didn't ride in it very often because he was Western. So they just bought this Western. one, Western, and they just bought it so that he had an English saddle. Um, and this one just happens to probably be for sale, maybe be for sale at our barn for a good price. And it's similar color, a bit smaller, I think, like size-wise for Gabby, which is good. And um, fits Storm, it fits him. And if all works out, you'll have a new saddle, huh? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And I like how this is black because like, mine's brown, turning black. Mm -hmm. my life. Mm -hmm. I mean, this is soft. I have a cold. You have a cold? <laughs> okay, so I'm riding blue again today. And one of you guys said that the benefit of him doing the lesson himself is that I could work on all my things, like my balance and my hands and um, all that kind of stuff. And it really made me think like, hey, that's kind of cool. So I'm going to try and ride him today. I'm going to not scream. I'm just going I'm just going to be calm even if I take the whole entire lesson to just get the feel of him. That's my plan. All right, let's boogie it up.
with your thighs. No, she said it's a lot easier with that. I saw it too. With the left down can work. Oh yes. You have a rep? No, you have one more lap. <laughs> you got this. Do your last lap sitting. Summer. Good times. Thank you. All right, I walk. So I have to change the way I drive. Yeah. Yeah. The outside light changes. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Pardon? <laughs> Just sit for two bumps or stand for two bumps. Oh my God, Blue. He says, I'm just teaching you to write. She's gotta learn someday, Gabby. <laughs> Prepare to canter! Can kiss! Go, Blue, go! No screaming. No screaming, mom. That's what it feels like to jump. <laughs>
No screaming. back when you ask. because the camera wouldn't press wouldn't let me press record She's resetting him because I've wrecked him. I did wreck him, but I had a really good time and I only screamed a little. And I'm excited now. I'm excited to master blue.
forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.